Yo guys, and today we've got the Watford versus uh, Leicester versus Watford match watch along. Now, this was supposed to be a match day vlog. This was supposed to be a match day vlog. However, I caught COVID, so I couldn't go. So, unfortunately, I have to watch it from here instead of being at the ground. Two away games I was supposed to go to in the space of less than a month. Burnley away got called off. Leicester away, I caught COVID. It's just my luck, isn't it? Anyway, yeah, but let's get straight into this. Come on, you it's, it's the magic of the FA Cup. Leicester away, so it's going to be very tough. They're the holders. But you've got, you can never say you can't win. Right, we're going to go with a 1 0 Watford, a 2 1 Watford. Let's get straight into this. Come on, Watford. First chance comes to Leicester there, the free kick. The free kick, James Madison, it was hit straight at the wall. Fell to one of their players out on the right, took a deflection and hit it off, number, headed by number 62. Dodgy bounce, but Daniel Batman comes comes out to catch it. Four minutes in already, but it's still nil-nil. Oh! Leicester have got a penalty. Serie Alta, stupid challenge. Five minutes in, they've been dominating the game, and they've got a fair and square penalty. Oh, that is a bit light, isn't it? I want to see that again. Is there another replay? There, yeah, there is. Oh, his hands are all over. He he's jumped. He's well jumped, but his hands are all over him. VAR's not going to overturn that. Really silly. Tielemans versus Backman. Five, well, six minutes in now. Come on, Dan. Come on, Dan. Bottom left hand corner. Yeah, it was two. Oh, it was Tielemans. Yuri Tielemans makes it 1 0. Bottom left hand corner. It was a very good penalty, to be fair. Daniel Backman went this right way, but had no chance. Absolutely devastated. A second time in a row in the cup that we've conceded early on. I bet you this game is just going to be a comfortable 1 0 win for Leicester now, isn't it? They, it's just going to be a boring 90 minutes now. 1 0 Leicester. 2 0. 2 0 inside 24 minutes. Game over. Game over. It's not half, not even half an hour in, but I'm calling game over. Because we don't really look like scoring one. We probably had like one chance that we blazed well over the bar. James Madison. Had it, they had it out on the right. He's onside. Just a massive, massive gap in the defence. There's, there's about three at the back. I don't know where the fourth one is. You've got one here and then you've got one here and you've got one well over there. And they're just going through the gap. So easy. So easy. 25 minutes in, it's 2 0. Go on! Go on! Yes! 2 1! It's not game over, Joe Pedro! 2 1! Come on! Long ball over the top. Joe Pedro. It was headed. I can't quite see who that was that played it to him. Fell to Jal Pedro one on one. He puts it in the back of the net. Just turns out it's not game over. Instantly, within a minute or two, the game's turned on its head. About 26 minutes in, it's 2 1. Ref! See yellow. He's off! That's a yellow. He's already on a yellow. That is a yellow. He's on a yellow card. Come on, that's a blatant yellow card. Don't bottle... Mike Dean has bottled this. Mike Dean has bottled this. How is that not a second yellow card? I'm absolutely tired, probably because I have COVID. But... That's... That's a blatant yellow card. He's on a yellow as well. It's Sissoko getting booked for descent. How has he not been double yellowed for that? That is embarrassing. VAR's in, in it, isn't it? 
That is such a blatant yellow. Cannot believe that. Go on. Oh! Oh my gosh! Right on stoppage time of half time. Good save from Ward. I think it is in goal. I think it's Jeremy Ngakia who absolutely did the defender. Jao Pedro with a shot. And Gakia had another one and two good saves from the keeper, but that really should have been a goal. It's going to be half time. Leicester 2, Watford 1. That Leicester player shouldn't be on the pitch. That should easily be a double yellow. But it was a good start from Leicester. Poor start from us. We've had a better 25 minutes or so. Uh, especially since we scored. We do look like we could get an equaliser to touch with though. But um, yeah, it's game on. It's, it's definitely only one's game coming out in the second half. I know they're 2-1 up. But we just have to make a far, uh, quick start. Hopefully get a goal and see what happens. Oh, good chance for Watford. Jao Pedro had it out on the left. Didn't know what to do with it. Two fan had a shot. Quite far over the bar, but it's a good start to the second half. It's kind of promising. Yeah, 46 minutes and still 2-1. Go on, Jao. Go on! Ben! Let's have a look at this. Plays it to Fletcher. Nah, that's a dive. That is, well, it looks like a dive from that angle. Fletcher went down. Nah, yeah, that is a dive. That is a dive. 49 minutes and still 2-1. But again, this is better. Whee! Leicester has scored a disallowed goal offside. I find this game boring. I don't, I don't know why. Because it's 2-1. Literally almost 3-1. Um, ball played out on the right. He's on side. He's actually on. I don't know if there's VAR. There is. Barnes hit it in the back of the net, but he is on side. He's on. He's gone to VAR. He's he's on. It's three one. They're checking it. He's on. He is on. I saw that from the first replay and he's given it. 3-1. Oh, we can't defend. I know it's a bit of a weak team. I don't know. No, it's not. And yeah, 55 minutes in, Harvey Barnes makes it 3-1 to Leicester. Oh, the lights have gone out. <laughs> Oh, and now they're back. I think they're back. I don't think they are. <laughs> Floodlights have gone out. We pay your benefits. <laughs> they can't afford the bills to pay for the lights. Oh my gosh, 57 minutes in, 3-1. Still 3-1. Imagine the game gets abandoned because like, they can't afford the floodlights. Then hopefully <laughs> we'll start again at 0-0 and I'll be able to go to the game. But no, that's not going to happen. Oh, f games. The lights are back on. I thought maybe the game could get abandoned whilst we're 3 1 down and the floodlights will stay off, but no, the floodlights have come back on. Well, I guess at least the game's going to carry on. 6 2 minutes. Watford fans singing, You're nothing special, we lose every week. That is so true. So true. I wish I was there. Leicester are obsessed with us. I don't know if. We're living in their head or something, but they're singing Watford get battered everywhere we go. We're not even rivals. I don't know. Bunch of weirdos. I don't know. Embarrassing Leicester. Tim Pot FC. <laughs> go on. Oh, he's in the bar. He's in the bar. Here it was, so. Ball whipped in. Played in. Joe Pedro, it's deflected and hits the bar, and then it was cleared, literally from like the penalty spot. Oh my gosh, brilliant save. It's 4 1. 4 1 to Leicester. It's not been 
we've not really put out the strongest squad, but that has been a an awful performance. Let's see, I didn't even see the goal. Go to him! I don't get we allowed him to have so much space. Good save from Batman, but the defence was completely non existed. They played around with it in our own box about eighty four minutes in it's it's four one to Leicester. Leicester fans are embarrassing. They are truly embarrassing. They're all they single game is Watford get battered everywhere they go, even though we're not even even though we're not even close to being rivals. Bunch of bloody weirdos. Full time. Our oh, very short cut run comes to an end. Leicester City 4, Watford 1. Oh, I mean, it was a young team, kind of an inexperienced team. But it was a very poor performance. I don't know, no Dennis, no King, no Saar. But, yeah, it is what it is, really. No Sissoko, but that was really boring. The fact that I sat through that. I'm, I'm still glad I didn't go. Like it's all about not just the game, but the day. I guess it would have been a good day out. But yeah, next game is a relegation six pointer. I know it's only January, but you have to admit that it is. Newcastle might buy their way out of it. We'll never know. But Watford versus Newcastle, or oh, Newcastle will be Watford. I'm excited for it. For unfortunately, I won't be going to it, but I'll be watching it here. You don't want to miss that because that's a big, big game. Drop a like if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.